So I will say it now, this video will probably light a fire on my channel, I won't try to extinguish it because I will not take back anything I say or I won't regret anything I say for the matter because some of it might be wrong but most of it is true and you also know it's true. The commentary community is a watered down lazy fucking pathetic shithole that no one takes criticism and they have this false belief of free speech in which if you say you don't agree with someone else you're both retarded and don't believe in free speech but if you say they are wrong and explain why and you're still in the right you are still the one that doesn't believe in freedom of speech ironically and this goes for most of the commentary community like seriously this shit that I'm part of is the most, and I mean most, hypocrite, shallow, sad, and not really depressing community you will find. Besides the gas shower, besides the beauty community which either attack each other for no apparent reason or that start useless drama for profit, I guess. The commentary community is the absolute definition of desperation and the smaller part of the commentary community which is basically the smaller youtubers is even more of a circle jerk than the big ones where the quote unquote big dogs are at, right? So imagine, it's bad enough with the big youtubers, you might say how worse can it get with the smaller ones? Let me say, it's a pretty bad circle jerk we're looking at right now. And think of it this way, when your whole channel is sucking off other channels dicks for growth, you ain't much of a channel because the viewers are not gonna watch every video you make unless it's on that specific drama or the specific person they subscribe for. Unless it's about someone else they also are subscribed to, they won't watch it. And then there's the videos I hope are ironic, but most likely they aren't ironic. So it's kinda unlucky for me I guess. Then there is the moment when they get attacked for shit they say or do. The, they go ape shit when that happens, or they just decide to be little pussies and beg for the people attacking them to stop doing it. When the main point they have when they attack each other is the fact they call each other leafy clones, or as more recently, uh, there's the Turkey Tom clone and the Right Opinion clone, which I mean is kinda stupid, but sure. Whatever floats your boat, right? Then again, there is the text-to-speech MLG Fox, which attack people because they get criticism for using the text-to-speech, and then they say to not take it personally when they start attacking someone based on criticism. And the best way of defending the video format they have is saying, using text-to-speech isn't bad as long as there's humor and comedic value. Hey everyone, welcome back with a video but edgy as fuck. So welcome back to Worst Fandoms, where we talk about fandoms that some people say that are the worst. Hey everyone, welcome back with a video but edgy as fuck. Hey guys, that was funny, right? That shit was hilarious, wasn't it? That's comedy, guys, don't you get it? It's fucking comedy! It's comedy left, goddammit! So today we're gonna be talking about a dog shit commentator or wants dog shit. Which not only sounds gay as fuck, but is also hypocritical. I think I'll probably be dead by the time I'll actually laugh a bit at this.
Now you might be familiar with the term of a bottom feeder or a bottom feeding in general, right? And most channels are to blame for it. Heck, I might be at blame for it since I might have done it in the past, but I don't think I personally did, it's very unlikely. But there is a channel that revolves around the concept of being a bottom feeder, which goes by the name of LT Syntax. Even if his video editing is, and his thumbnails are not the most amazing, they're pretty ne decent, I guess. But they became as generic and overused as my style. My style could be shit for all I care, but I try to not make it as overused as the other commentary channels around. And while he could be a good or decent channel and have a pretty nice growth, he tries to weasel his way to fast growth by sacrificing his dignity and potentially good content for the matter. And yeah, that still doesn't save him from the fact he can only get views and shit like that by making videos defending on or attacking someone else, which is pretty pathetic in my eyes. While I could obviously try and dig more to find more shit wrong with this community, I won't do it because it's already making me fucking depressed, dead inside, whatever. Making this video alone, as short as it might be because it could be a lot longer and much more painful for both me and them, painful for me to make and for them to listen to, but yeah, I won't do it. I don't want to. I want to at least keep somewhat my dignity and try to not sleep as low as them. I know I already sleep pretty low by making this video, but yeah, at least I don't suck as hard as them. They also swallow. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the small video. It's kind of a rant video, I guess. I could put it as that. But um, yeah, subscribe, like the video if you enjoyed it, and yeah, see you in the next one.